Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel CAT Tutorials for Beginners. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about how to use keyboard shortcuts for using different commands like line, circle, uh, extrude, hole. We are, we are going to see this uh, with the help of keyboard shortcuts. So first let's create one model here. So I will, I will keep this as it is and let's keep the part name also as it is okay so so now uh, to use a keyboard shortcut we need to use the alt key and plus the different shortcuts are available for the creo so let me first select the sketch here and then select the face and just so now let's say i want to create one rectangle so if you see the rectangle is under the sketch tab right so just press alt on the keyboard and then you will see the key key uh, letter for the sketch so again and press k so once you are you are in inside the sketch tab then you can see for line there is shortcut is li so you can just type li from the keyboard and then you will see it is reflected at line and now it goes inside the line uh, drop down so we have two different options line chain and line tangents so we need the first line chain so we can enter line from the keyboard so you can see the line command is activated now and now we can create the line here so we can create a line chain like this similarly uh, let's say maybe i, I will just uh, exit this and then I will create one extrude here again I will use control D and then click OK so now I will I will uh, again sketch on this face here let's select OK and now I will create a rectangle here so let's say you are in the model tab now again if you click if you type alt from the keyboard shortcut it will show up all the tab shortcuts here and now you, you need to go inside key that is inside sketch just type key from the keyboard you will see all the uh, options from the sketch tab are again uh, uh, you can see visible to you and then you can select the rectangle which is the re so type re from the keyboard it will go inside the re rectangle drop down and then you can see different uh, types of rectangles are available so let's select c that is center rectangle so type c from the keyboard you will see the center rectangle is activated and now you can create a rectangle here which is center rectangle and then just click ok so in this way you can you can use different uh, uh, shortcuts here for all the, the commands uh, available in creo parametric so now let's say if you want to extrude it so again i will press alt and then after that you need to go to the m then the model uh, tab and then for x2 you can extrude you can see uh, the shortcut is x so type x from it and then you can see uh, the extrude command gets activated here and then just click ok so in this way you can use the extrude command as well so let's say you want to uh, apply some fillets or chamfers for this so again uh, type alt from the keyboard then go inside the model tab and then for round on chamfer you can see ha and ru for round so let's say i will use round so again it, it goes inside the round drop down here and then type u for the round so now you can see the round uh, tab is activated now uh, the command is activated now and uh, it will ask for you to select edge or chain of edges or the surface to create a round set so let's select this with a mouse button here i will select this four here and then click on ok now you can see the round is applied similarly you can do for the chamfer so let's try one more uh, type alt from the uh, keyboard then m for the model tab and then for chamfer it's ha so ha it will go to the a chamfer and a corner chamfer so let's choose here uh, a chamfer that is g 
and then you can see this is the edge chamfer and then select the edges it select an edge edge or chain of edges to create a chamfer set just select this edge here and then you can obviously modify the dimensions here and then you can just click ok so it will apply the chamfer for it so in this way uh, you can use different commands here so let's say um, if i uh, type again alt from the uh, keyboard shortcut so if you want to go inside analysis then you can just simply uh, press analysis here and then you will see all the options from the analysis tab similarly similarly let's say if you want to go to the uh, annotate then you can see uh, you can you can go to the annotate tab here so you will see all the options of another tab so in this way you can use different shortcuts uh, for this all these tabs here and you can use the commands so again go to this so just remember we need to uh, type alt to use any commands in the creo parametric so thanks for watching please do subscribe and like our video for more videos thank you so much